At Care Patreon, we are constantly looking at ways to improve. If you have any feedback on how we can improve our videos and resources, please leave us a comment in the comment section below. Follicle stimulating hormone, or FSH, plays a key role in the development of the reproductive system. It's used a lot in both diagnosing and treating conditions related to reproductive health. An FSH levels chart is a handy tool that shows the normal range of FSH levels at different stages of life and throughout the menstrual cycle. So why is FSH so important? For individuals assigned female at birth, FSH helps with maturation of ovarian follicles. These are the structures in the ovaries that hold developing eggs. For those assigned male at birth, FSH supports the growth and development of sperm. The FSH levels chart lays out what's considered normal for FSH levels across different contexts. For example, These ranges can vary a bit depending on the lab and factors like weight and health conditions can also influence FSH levels. Here is how to use the FSH levels chart. Download the template. Start by getting the FSH levels chart template on your device. You can download it through the link in the description or you can sign up to our app for free where you'll have access to thousands of templates. Identify patient information. Determine the patient's age, gender, and any relevant conditions like pregnancy or menopause. This will help you choose the right FSH range from the chart. Compare test results. Look at the patient's FSH test results and compare them with the normal ranges on the chart. Interpret abnormal results. If the FSH levels are outside the normal range, the chart can help you understand what might be going on, whether the levels are high or low. Monitor and re-evaluate. Keep an eye on FSH levels over time, scheduling follow-up tests as needed to maintain hormonal balance. When should you use an FSH levels chart? When assessing fertility. It's a great tool for understanding fertility. Abnormal FSH levels might point to reproductive issues. Determining menopausal status. High FSH levels can indicate menopause or even premature menopause. Understanding the menstrual cycle. This chart helps track FSH fluctuations during the cycle, which is important for assessing reproductive health. During pregnancy, monitoring FSH levels in early pregnancy can provide insights into how the pregnancy is processing. What do the results mean? High FSH levels in females can indicate menopause or conditions like polycystic ovary syndrome. In males, high levels might suggest testicular issues affecting sperm production. Low FSH levels in males could signal problems with the brain areas that regulate hormones. Here is a sample of our FSH levels chart to give you an idea of how it can be used in your practice. To explore more of our free templates, visit our template library on the Care Patron website linked in the description below. Care Patron is a practice management software known for its comprehensive features and signing up is free. Just click on the sign up link in the description. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our Care Patron channel for more content like this.